Hey everybody, I just want to say, I want to thank all my fans for being so positive, for showing me so much love on my DMs, on my Instagram and everything. You know, it was, it's been, it was, this week for me was very exciting. You know, I put my record out. I put my record out. I had so much great plans. And, um, you know, it's a lot of bad controversy. Somebody hacked in my dude's phone, email, phone. I've been getting, like, weird text messages. And I, I honestly don't know who the hell it is. There has been an investigation going on, and we're getting closer and closer to finding out. Because, you know, shit always comes to light. But, um, you know, I just really hated that all this controversy and all this crazy shit. I really hate when shit like this happens because it takes away from my work. It takes away from my plans. Like, you know, my plans was Barty or Cardi, Barty or Cardi, Barty or Cardi. Barty or Cardi, you know, Barty or Cardi. And it's just like, I feel like the focus is not on my shit. Because it's just, you know, the gossip always overbeats. The negative always overbeats when it comes to this internet shit. But I just want to say thank you to everybody that been um downloading Barty or Cardi. It, the record is doing so good. And it, it really has boosted my confidence, you know. Like, it's so scary you there's the thing like when i when I do music when I first do music and everything when I be in the the studio, I do it and I have a lot of fun it's it's love like when I did board like yellow when I did all my songs before board like yellow like I just go in the the studio and i and I focus and I have fun and everything now it's not even like fun it's just like work like it's like it's work and it's just like oh my god i hope this is the one this is the one this is the one oh i hope this is okay because everybody have these crazy high expectations and i just want to be a free uh, artist that express myself in my own way you know i like to do music that i like um i like you know my way i, I and i also like to do things that I know is going to make me money. You know what I'm saying? Like, I could rap a certain type of style, but I feel like if this, if it's not the wave, I'm not going to do it because I, I do music because of a passion, but I also do it because I want to make money. Like everybody else, I want to make money and I want to capitalize. And I want to capitalize. Like, the fuck? Like, you know what I'm saying? And I just want to say thank you, everybody. Um... I said this before on my videos, right? I said this before on my video. Like, God has been very good. It has been very good. It's like I come from a place when good things happen, fuck shit starts to happen. So, you know, little, um, uh, you know, like, things were going too good. That is like, ugh, bad things happen. But things have been so positive today. It's been a very good day for me. I prayed a lot, I prayed a lot, I prayed a lot, and it is just being better. It's, it's peace. It's peace in my home. It brought it brought me so much close to my family. My family been with me these past two, three days, supporting me, loving me, and, you know, my fiancé, things are going way better. We're talking, we're actually getting a little closer, and we're having a better understanding, you know? And... Oh, what can I do? Live and you learn, right? This shit could be worse. And 2018 is crazy how me and my team, every single day, me and my glam team, me and my publicist, we talk every single day how we're going to elevate for 2018. And yeah, and, and I've been working a lot on a lot of shit that y'all don't know nothing about that y'all going to see on 2018. And it's going to be great. Positivity. I want all my fans to always be positive, you know? Like, I know I'm retarded, so y'all know y'all got to defend me a lot. But it's just like, I'm going to be violating the rest of 2017 when I see something that I don't like. Uh, but uh, 2018, I, I just can't wait. Like, I just want it to be so 
positive, so happy. Problems and everything. Ugh, can't wait till this year is just over. And thank you, everybody. Thank you for downloading my shit. You know, I'm re- I'm a little sad because if anybody knows me, y'all know that my dad, he is like my best friend. He's like my psychic. He does everything for me. And this motherfucker, he's he he went to the Dominican Republic, but it's cool because my dad haven't been in the Dominican Republic for 15 years. So it makes me sad because I miss my daddy. But um, I I love the fact that he's like he. My dad don't tell me these type of things because my dad is like me. We don't like saying like I love and we proud. No, we're we not gushy like that. We. Even my little brother, like, we don't we don't like all that gushy stuff. Like, we're very sensitive. We just don't like all that stuff. We barely even cry. But we very sensitive. We just don't really cry. My dad called me the other day drunk as fuck. And he was like, oh, my gosh. P- I just be going to every club. I be going every deep where I be in the, ra- I hear the radio station. And I cannot believe that they keep mentioning my daughter. I can't believe they know my daughter out here in the Dominican Republic. Your record with Osuna is everywhere. I'm so proud of you guys. Uh, and my dad was saying how he was so scared that me and Hennessy was going to like, because we really live as bad kids. Me and my sister was terrible, like. Terrible, but it's like you know what I'm saying. He's just so happy that we mature, and he's so happy that my sister mature too. Cause my sister is bad. She bad. Y'all think I'm bad? My sister's really the bad one. She's the angry one. She's the firecracker one. She's the one. She's gonna do so good in 2018. She's so beautiful. I love her. My my sister I'll be calling her my daughter. Cause it's like you know what I'm saying. I told her a lot of things. I mean, her really strong. And, uh, yep, yep, yep. In 2018, I'm expecting, you guys are going to expect a lot of good features. I did a lot of good features 2018. Um, I'm working on my album still. You know what I'm saying? Because on my album, I want to I wanna show y'all more girl side of me. But I also, you know, want to keep it hood or everything. I want to keep things the same. I want to wanna do music that I like. So, you know, the album. I'm barely going to do bookings in January, which makes me sad because, you know what I'm saying? Like, I like that booking money, but it's like, <laughs> you know, I'm going to focus a lot. Working on my album every um, I'm planning to buy a house in Jersey, even though I'm... Me and my dude are planning to build something in Atlanta, but um, I need something always in New York because I'm from New York. You know what I'm saying? And even though I don't even stay in the place I live at, barely. I just love going to my grandmother's house or to my aunt's house or to my cousin's house in the hood to live there. Because, you know, I live in a place that is really nice and everything. But after 10 o'clock, everything is closed. Everything is closed. Even the McDonald's be closed. And it's just like a bitch like me hate cooking. So, you know, I, just stay, I like to stay in Washington Heights in the Bronx where I could, like, just walk up the street and get me some chopped cheese. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's really... It's so hard to take a girl out the hood. It's just really hard, you know? And what else I'm expecting for 2018? I hope I win that Grammy. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I'm grateful that I'm nominated. I feel like a winner already because a bitch is nominated. Like, I ain't never thought we'd be nominated for a Grammy. But it's like, if I win, you know... I was thinking of bringing my, you know, since this is in New York, I was thinking of bringing my mom or my sister to the Grammys. But I feel like if I lose, I'm going to cry because just seeing my sister face makes me emotional. And it's like if I win, I'm going to cry too because just looking at my sister face and my mom's face make me emotional. But so I'm just going to keep them home. And if I win that Grammy, that would be really dope. You know what I'm saying? So I'm going to put that, uh, that's that's something that I pray about every night. And yep, 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 yep. Uh, thank you, everybody. Thank you. Like I said, it has been, I'm not even going to lie to you guys. I'm not going to be acting like, yeah, I'm fine, this, this, and that. I am fine. I was just a little bit overwhelmed, you know, that somebody would try to do something malicious. 
trying to expose shit, whatever the fuck, during the during the um, holidays. But you know, karma got a sister named Dharma. You know what I'm saying? If I did something bad to somebody and that was my karma, then I guess that's my karma. But somebody got a sister named Dar. Karma got a sister named Dharma. So, but I'm I'm so happy today. I don't know why. It's just I pray I pray to God that that for, to bring me happiness, and He did. Like today, I just woke up in such a good spirit, such a good energy, and. Yep. Yep. I'm just glad that I never pretended to be something that I'm not. Because imagine if I was like the type of person to be like, yeah, I'm a serious woman. Yeah, I'm like a secretary. Yes, I'm religious, this and that. And then like shit, like, you know, my ass, and, you know, my vagina out. It wouldn't look bad. But it's like, fuck it. You know what I'm saying? I just don't like the invasion of privacy. That's what bothers me. Invading my privacy. You know what I'm saying? Those are sacred things between me. Between me and I do. And thank you, everybody. Thank you so much. I I really want to go to the supermarket and get some some food to cook. But, yeah, I got to cook because I don't, I'm in Atlanta. So I don't know what the fuck there is to eat around here. I don't really like to eat um burgers and fries anymore. Like, it's just... I mean, I'm telling you, once you hit 25, your body acts very different. Like, I can't even eat red meat anymore. And I love me some steak. And I love me some dick. And it's just like, I can't even. You know what I'm saying? Like, certain things just getting me sick. So, um, really want to cook some.